But anyway, I was having a conversation with Vivian Vulture, yeah. who was a kind of a benevolent witch okay. type puppet. All right. She had a pointed hat, you yeah. know, and uh, she had a screechy yeah. voice. Yeah. And uh, I, I was having a conversation with her. She would appear in the uh, upright piano. We called it the Peppy Piano. Right. And I would sit on the piano bench and talk to Vivian. I'd say, and the voice I used for Commodore Cappy was sort of Lionel Barrymore, <laughs> uh, mixed with uh, Walter Brennan in yeah. Heat. Right. <laughs> and uh, that voice sounded That's hard something. To <laughs> Walter well, Brennan. Well, I'll do it for you. I know okay. you can imagine it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Jumping jellyfish. Chop down my mission mast and call me toothpick. I'll be a silly shark. It's Vivian Vulture. Vivi, it's Valentine's Day is coming up. I suppose you're going to get a lot of Valentine's, aren't you? And that's a, that is, oh, a round of applause, I think. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, that's an Great honor. Great performance, John. Honor of Lionel Barrymore. Oh, I, I, all right. He put food on my table for two years. Yeah, yeah. Indeed. And I said to Vivi, you're going to get a lot of Valentine's, Vivi. And she sort of choked and sobbed, yeah. and yeah. they took a close-up of this little hand puppet. Yeah. wasn't any bigger than this. Right. And uh, I, I can't do her voice the way Stoltz or Ketchum did it, but she said, oh, oh, no, no, Commodore. See, my name was Commodore Cappy. No, I, I won't get a lot of Valentine's. In fact, I won't get any in my whole life. Yeah. I've, I've never had one Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, I was commiserating with Vivian, yeah, and, and sure. this is what I did. I reached in and took yeah. my hanky and wiped yeah. a tear, and I yeah. said, Vivi, maybe you'll get one this yeah. year, yeah. you know. And that's all we did. That was I it. swear, that's all yeah. we did. Right. And the next day, the Valentine's address to Vivian Vulture, WCCO-TV, Channel 4, started rolling in. And the first day, we got 10 Valentines. Yeah. The next day, 50. The next day, 100. The next day, 1,000. At the end of two weeks, and this is absolutely true, Vivian Vulture, the little hand puppet, yeah. received at our studios in downtown Minneapolis 10,000 Valentines. Great. What a story. Stop and think. Yeah. And all of a sudden, Don Stoltz and I looked at each other. My God, what have we unleashed here? Right. This, yeah. this, with a little puppet, sure. to have that kind sure. of a response. That's, that's, that's amazing. You know, those yeah. kids out there are with us every step of the way. Right. We realized we had captured this audience. And, and we, we considered it a tremendous responsibility. Oh, so we yeah. better be darn sure, sure. Uh, that what we say is... And good taste, and uh, yeah. we want to have fun, but we don't want to let the children down. Right. And that was the challenge. And it was early on, yeah. uh, Gene, yeah. after yeah. Commodore Cappy had been on the air for just a few yeah. months. Quite a story. Yeah.